we give you scriptures uh, to follow each month. And I don't give you a lot. I give you one scripture. Because I know if I give you a lot, what will happen? You're not going to do it. <laughs> You're not going to learn it. But here, here's the philosophy behind that. Guys, if you come and you, you can take that scripture and you can memorize that scripture, at the end of the year you'll have 12 scriptures that you will be loaded with. And there's nothing, nothing better to wage war but scripture. That's what God gives us. But I'm going to throw a little, little wrinkle in this. Uh, I was going to be talking about the scripture that we had on the website, and about a week and a half ago, God really gave me a download. And He said, you need to be looking at this, and it's just been hitting me day after day after day. <clears throat> and so it, it goes like this. It says, when you pass through the waters, I will be with you. And when you pass through the rivers, they will not sweep over you. When you walk through the fire, you will not be burned. The flames will not set you ablaze. And this was in Isaiah. And Isaiah was one of the first prophets that came out. And you, you, last night, I always try to give you guys some history about this. He was really one of the first prophets uh, that was in here. And when that happened, he, when he came on the scene, everybody loved him. Man, he's great. He's wonderful. And he went through two rulers that way. And then in the third ruler... As he started telling people, hey, you've got to stop this sin nature. You've got to turn from that. You've got to come to the one true God. And his popularity got smaller and smaller and smaller. And eventually what ended up happening is they, they, they killed him. And sometimes it's not always the, the, the coolest thing to be a Christian. Sometimes we're put to a test. But as, I, as I, I'm reading through here and, and I'm telling you this verse... And again, it's, it's Isaiah 43, 2, if you want to write that down. And guys, I'm sorry I, I, I switched that on you this month, but I really felt like uh, we needed that. And with this ice storm and everything that's happened, we need to look at that. And really what it's saying is, as we go through difficulties, and we go through these rivers and these streams, if God is with us and we believe and we're focused and we're heading in that direction of where He's at, He is not going to let us drown. But what it's also saying in that scripture is, guys, if we fight the fight and we fight it on our own, then, then you're taking a shot of, are you going to go to the bottom of that river? Because God's not there, because you've, you've said no. So it's a choice that you have to make. But what God is saying is, if you follow me, and you take up the word, and you move in that direction... No matter if you're on the top of the top or on the bottom of the bottom, I will always be there with you. So invite me into your life and I will, I will stay strong with you. And that's what God is saying right here. And so that's what I'm, I'm, I'm telling you guys. Sometimes it's tough and that's why we meet here. So that not only can we meet other Christian men, but we can also meet other Christian businessmen that are going through some of the same battles right now. Some of the things that may be coming up in your job or some of the things that we have some men here that, that may not have a job right now that are fighting through that and, and we've never had to go through that before. Or they've walked in and said, hey, we don't want this product. We don't want to do this thing. And that's one of the reasons why we meet so that we can open up. Because as men, we don't really do that, but we should. And so that's why I'm saying, you know, God is always there with you. He's going to pull you out. When you feel like you're drowning, He's not going to let you do that. He may test you, but guys, what I'm saying is keep your eyes focused on Christ and keep moving in that direction and get into this. And I'm not saying you have to know everything because you, you, you never will. But learn it, go over it and go over it and use it. And I guarantee God will put somebody in your path that you'll be able to use this and help them. And so that's my, that's my challenge. That's the scripture. I'm sorry I switched it up on you, but that's really a download that I got last week. I know a lot of you guys.